Hey everybody and welcome to my channel. I'm here doing a crosswatcher series for those of you dealing with an ex-partner who is born under the sun sign, moon sign, rising, or Venus of Libra. So, alright, the first card out. That was quick. The Knight of Pentacles. So, um, moving slowly in the direction they're meant to go. The Four of Swords in Reverse is out next. Followed by Death. The Five of Wands. Ooh. The Eight of Wands. And the Magician. Wow. Very powerful energy for Libra this week. Um, the overall issues that they are dealing with is the Five of Swords in Reverse, clarified by the High Priestess in Reverse, and the Six of Swords. So they are, uh, they're no longer dealing with this uh, win-at-all-cost energy. Um, however, they are not following their intuition um, about moving forward. Their, their angels are trying to tell them it's time to move. It's time to go. It's time to leave the backstabbing uh, heartache of these swords um, in the past. So they are walking away from somebody who, uh, who shared this energy with them. But they're not quite moving forward towards you just yet. The universe is trying to reach them, try to speak to them through their intuition, and they're just not following it. Um, or their intuition could be off a little bit. Um, your ex is, your ex Libra, uh, his feelings or her feelings, whichever, um, they are moving forward, but very slowly. Like I said, they're moving out of wherever they're at, whoever they're with, but and they are moving in your direction. But it's probably not as fast as what you would like it to be. Their, uh, their current thoughts are they don't know what to think. They're um, not quite ready to uh, reflect within, to go within and rest and, and really heal and take time to think about the situation because they're just wanting out of the heartache. They're just wanting out of this situation where they feel um, all this pain. Um, their feelings currently is they feel they're, they're letting go of the past. They are transforming into somebody who can leave that pain behind. They are really going through a spiritual rebirth. They are reaching out. Um, they could be watching like videos on YouTube. They're like researching what you know, what they're going through, what it means. Some of them could possibly be going through the dark night of the soul currently, but um, they're really allowing themselves to shed their old skin. They feel like it's time. It's time to put things to rest that no longer um, serve me. It's time to move forward. It's time to recreate what I want my life to be and who I want to be. Their um, wishes, their hopes is just to really get out of this place of conflict, whether it be with people um, that they're dealing with or whether it be their inner conflict. But no matter what, they're just wishing that they could not have to deal with this intense um, emotional battle between themselves, you know, within themselves or people around them that are constantly telling them what to do. They feel like they have to um, constantly battle for someone's attention, possibly for some of you. Um, their outside influence is uh, the eight of wands. So very quick, direct communication. There's a lot of people trying to reach them. There's a lot of people trying to put their input in, give their two cents um, when their two cents isn't wanted. They have a lot of people who are up in their business. A lot. Way too many people are trying to tell them what to do, who to be with, where to go, how to feel, and they're just really sick of it. The outcome is the magician. 
right underneath the death card. This is amazing. Libras are going through a major transformation, uh, spiritual rebirth, and they now realize they have um, learned through the years, through the lessons, through the relationships. They have learned what they want and what they don't want. They know now what it was that that didn't make relationships work in the past, but they also know what it's going to take to make a relationship work in the past. So they're going to begin to manifest um, using the knowledge that they have acquired over um, the past, the past relationships, the ups, the downs. They're going to use that to rebuild and manifest a beautiful connection with you. This is exactly what the Twin Flame journey is about. Taking and gathering up all the lessons that we've learned over lifetimes, over years, over all these different relationships, then to purge out everything that does not um, align with the lessons we have learned, and then manifest an amazing connection with the twin. What else do they need to know about their Libra partners? This is really, really amazing energy. Your Libras are working very hard. Yeah, they may um, currently be uh, very uh, closed off. Emotionally unavailable is what they are right now. But that's only because they're trying to get through this process of rebuilding themselves that they can't really worry about someone else's um, taking care of someone else's emotions right now. And I don't mean that in a, in a mean way or like uh, to offend anybody, but they really have to concentrate right now on their own feelings. They have to uh, decipher what, what all this new information that they're getting, all these downloads are getting. They really have to decipher what their own feelings are at the moment that um, they, they can't focus on sharing their emotions right now until they figure out what they are. They can't share what they don't know. And so they're just really trying to figure out what it is that they're feeling, uh, what they're going to do with these feelings, how to move these feelings forward with somebody else. But when they do, they will come forward and, um, and share that with you. They will come forward and, um, and they will be such a strong, stable person that people will come to for help. This is a strong healer. This is somebody that people flock to. And they don't even have to say a word. It's just their vibration. Their, um, their welcoming uh, feeling that when they walk in a room, people just are drawn to talk to them. That's what this person is going to be. She's e or He or she is either going to... Um, yeah, they're going to be just an amazing healer. This person is going to become very successful, very strong in what they contribute to the collective. Um, yeah, very strong energy uh, for this group of you. And they're going to use it for good. But they have to figure out how to use them, how, what to do. They have to figure out these tools and how to use them before they can come forward and, um, and offer them to you and the world. Whoa. Yeah. Wow. I was just saying how strong they're going to be. They're going to be very strong. The emperor is, this is amazing energy. They are going to be able to give you a life of love and abundance and stability and just everything your heart desires. This person will be able to give you um, if you remain patient because the wheel of fortune is here and the, the wheel is in the upswing. Things are going to become very, very positive for you both as well as in the time of Sagittarius. So continue to work on yourself, continue your healing journey, and um, they will be returning to you very, very soon with many blessings and many things to contribute to the relationship and to the collective. This is an amazing reading. If you're connecting with a Libra, you're lucky because this person is awesome. Okay. 
your advice from the angels is to flirt when this person does reach back out to you when they connect with you again if you are talking here and there make sure you extend a lighthearted and energy um when they contact you don't try to bring down the vibration the energy level by discussing heavy things just be flirty have fun and let this person know and remember how much fun they have with you how attracted they are to you because of your flirty lightheartedness and just have fun so all right guys i hope you enjoyed this reading on your libra exes um they will be returning to you and it is most definitely worth the wait so i hope you guys enjoyed this reading and i'll see you next time god bless